Um, good morning, my name is Nick Delia, uh, firefighter paramedic with the City of Rialto Fire Department located in Southern California. Um, we're here in Appleton, Wisconsin to um, take delivery of our new 107-foot uh, aerial ladder tiller truck. It is a 2019 uh, Velocity Cab and we're going to talk about some of the features um, here today. So, um, we went ahead with the black over red paint scheme. It's something we've changed back in 2016 with the city of Rialto when we ordered our two velocity puck pumpers. Um, and we changed our graphics. So we went ahead with the electric steps um, on the cab of the tractor to go ahead and uh, save on um, back and knee, leg, ankle injuries. So it's a nice feature that we worked with our um, salesman from South Coast Fire, Tim Olihan, to get those. And because we are a city of um, where we have uh, urban wildland interface, there might be a need sometime where we actually had to put a, a pump on our truck. So we have a Waterus 1500 GPM pump that has a 300 gallon uh, water tank on it. And just kind of moving along, um, all of our compartments will have a full complement of rescue and extrication and rope rescue gear, as well as uh, an EMS compartment back here that has the EMS gear. Um, some of the other features that we went with are um, the tiller cab has air conditioning, and we went ahead and added a shoreline to have the air conditioner powered while it's in the uh, station. So we'll be able to have the air conditioner um, fully functioning and on in the summertime due to the increased temperatures in Southern California. So we went, like I said, we went ahead and put that right here. It's one of the unique features that we found um, during our mid uh, inspection where we picked up from another department and um, it's the first in California for that. Coming around this way and continuing down the uh, the driver's side of the vehicle. Um, just like I said, we went ahead with to have a full complement of uh, not only fire suppression, but EMS gear. Um, since we are uh, a paramedic department where we do provide paramedic service to the community. Um, I don't know if I failed to mention, but Rialto is a community of about 110,000 people with a square mileage of about 22, 23 square miles. Um, and we run about 12,000 calls a year. I'm um, coming around this way. There's another um, features that I wanted to point out. Um, we worked since we have the the 2016 Velocity Pucks. We went ahead. We wanted to um, work with that pump, same pump configuration, and we worked diligently with our sales. Uh, sales agent Tim Oley from South Coast Fire and we worked with the engineering department here at Pierce where we were able to replicate um, the puck pump panel um, to have it um, with our aerial apparatus so we can keep everything uniform. Um, another unique feature to this uh, apparatus. So one of the things we wanted to change um, was to make sure that we're operating in a clean cab environment due to um, firefighter job related cancer. So we're storing all of our structure, fire protection gear and different compartments. We don't store it actually in the, inside the cab of the fire engine where the firefighters uh, ride to the calls. So we're storing the engineer and, ca and captain's gear and compartments that are accessible from outside the um, the cab and then the firefighters gear is actually going to be stored on the trailer part of the fire apparatus so they can get dressed. Um, we wanted to memorialize our uh, four fallen firefighters that the Rialto Firefighters Fire has had since um, existence. Um, the fire department first started in 1905. The city was incorporated in 1911 and unfortunately we've had four um, fatalities due to job related injury or illness. So we wanted to memorialize them um, on this uh, fire helmet here. Not only the victims, the fire victims of uh, 
9-11, the 343, but we put uh, Captain Walter Murray, firefighter, paramedic, Doug Stroop, engineer Johnny Thompson, and engineer S Scott Schwingle. So we will always have them uh, on our apparatus from now on. So that's pretty much an overview of the, the 2019 Velocity Tiller that the Rialto Fire Department is taking delivery of here today. And we can't wait to get it on the road and um, have it in service within the city of Rialto. Thank you.